What's going on, everyone? Chris from PickDogs.com here with your free pick in the Nebraska versus Illinois Week 4 college football matchup going down Friday, September 20th, 2024. Just a reminder, if you haven't already, make sure you're subscribed to our channel and smash that thumbs up. And if you're looking for my best bets, the games that I love, including my daily $19 best bet, head on over to PickDogs.com and click the Premium Picks tab at the top of the page. But let's get to this one between the Nebraska Cornhuskers and the Illinois Fighting Illini. And you got uh, Nebraska coming in 3-0 and on the year. Actually, both these teams are coming in 3-0, and but Nebraska's coming in 3-0, and both straight up and against the spread after picking up a 34-3 win over Northern Iowa in their last matchup, while Illinois comes in 3-0 and after a 30-9 victory over Central Michigan. And, um, you know, like I said, both these teams have gotten off to strong starts to the year. Both of them have been solid defensively, but I think the big thing for me is that I really like what Nebraska's brought to the table with Dylan Raiola at quarterback. I mean, he's got this confidence and this swagger about him, you know, that, you know, sometimes only freshmen really have. I mean, you know, he's just, he's coming in, he says he's modeled his game after Patrick Mahomes, and there are some days where you just look at what he's brought to the table and what he's put onto the field. And you see it, like you see what Dylan Raiola has done. And so far through, you know, the first three games, you know, he's got this Nebraska offense going from a team that last year really did next to nothing to, you know, a team that's top 10 nationally in completion percentage, you know, just outside the top 50 in passing yards per game. The offense has been moving along their top 50 in total offense. So I, I like the direction that this Nebraska offense is headed. And while well, Illinois' defense has been solid, neither one of these teams has really played anybody of consequence, but... Illinois especially, I mean, their toughest game so far has been Kansas. They won that game by five, but it was at home. Now they head out onto the road and winning on the road and sometimes even competing on the road in Big Ten Conference play is something that's just extremely hard to do. Uh, Nebraska, on the other hand, you know, they've had all their games at home as well so far, so at least they have the advantage of staying at home here. But this is a Nebraska team that just shut down what, what looked to be a really solid Colorado passing attack. And I'm just not a big fan of Luke Walt Altmyer at starting quarterback. You know, he's thrown for an average of around 215 yards per game in three games so far this season. His two best games have come against teams like Central Mish and Eastern Illinois. Um, but this East, you know, this Illinois offense, really nothing to write home about. You're going up against really a stout, you know, Nebraska defense that, you know, even when Nebraska was having their issues last season, sometimes they relied on that defense to keep themselves in and sometimes win football games. And out of the gate so far, this is a Nebraska defense that's top 25 in total yardage, yards per play allowed, top 15 in rushing yards allowed per game, top 20 in yards per carry allowed. The pass defense has been decent. So I just think at home, even laying just over a touchdown with Nebraska, I think that's where I want to be. I think Nebraska wins this one by 10 points, maybe like a 31 to 21 kind of game. So I'm going to go with Nebraska here. I'm going to lay the seven and a half, and that's going to be my free pick. But just a reminder, if you haven't already, make sure you're subscribed to our channel and smash that thumbs up. And if you're looking for my best bets, you can find those at Pick Dogs Premium. While you're Pick Dogs, check out our betting tools. They're 100% free. They're the best betting tools in the business. And tools that you want to make sure that you have in your back pocket when you're making your best bets for the day's action. Thanks for watching. See you guys soon.